Hey there, YouTuber. So doing a benchmark video. Haven't done one of these in a while. This is an i7 12700F. Let's go ahead and show you what you what we're working with. i7 12700F, MSI Z690A DDR4 motherboard, 16 gigs of RAM. Um, just got one of my crappier graphics cards on here. But uh, what we're going to do is basically check the temps on this here CPU cooler in different scenarios, and then compare it to a bunch of other ones. Now, later I'll do uh, some gaming with it, but uh, for now, we're just going to keep it at Intel's XTU and Cinebench R20. All right. Let me clear this out. So ideally, you know, we track this for a while and see the uh, what the low low is. It looks like it consistently is, is getting as low as 29 degrees with an average of 30. At least the last couple times. I've, I've had to reshoot this video twice, so um, that's basically what it's staying at. All right. So what we're going to do is... Benchmark this thing in here. Keep an eye on these guys. All right. Hitting the benchmark. So temp's going to shoot way up. Not enough to thermal throttle, it looks like, though, but... Enough to power limit throttle. You see that, folks, over here on the right? Power limit throttling. So the next run we do, we will resolve that. Now you saw we got up to 86. I may get rid of power limit throttling, but I may end up creating thermal limit throttling. So um, those are the chances you take, right, to increase your score in here. So 6710. This will be one, one of the things I compare in the chart. You'll see the score uh, and the temperature done this twice it was 84 the one time 86 now so let's go ahead and adjust this so power limits pl1 pl2 this is how you get rid of power limit throttling in one of three ways it's the only only way i do it but um now we can clear this hopefully now this cpu is going to run hotter now Give it a moment to see if it can drop below 31. When we run the benchmark, that is when it is definitely going to uh, be warmer. Let's see if it's dropped at all. Yeah, staying at 31. So that may be its new new uh, low. All right, let's go over to benchmarking. Yep, made it down to 30. So we're going to run this again. Keep an eye on these guys over here. And here. Actually, I'm going to wait till it gets off 35. Back down. All right. 30 degrees. Boom. Running. Should shoot up to well over 74 this time. Right off the bat. Yeah, hit 78 right away. 81. Now over here. So far good, 88 degrees, so definitely got hotter, and coming back down. So there was no thermal limit throttling or power limit throttling. You know, one day I'll just make a video, uh, we'll call it that. So the score XTU2 did go up, right? We are at uh, 72.15. Now we're going to hopefully have Cinebench on here somewhere. This is where if you guys want to tell me, hey, be, you should be better prepared, I'll take that one. We don't want Cinebench R23. So I'm sure, I'm pretty sure this computer has 
R20 on it. There it is. Okay. Nope. So, folks, there it is. Nope, that's our, there it is. All right, I apologize for a little bit of a delay. Just had to remember where it is. So we're going to run this, but uh, we're going to watch the numbers in XTU. So I'll make this a little bit smaller. Try and put it up over there. Oh. Let's try that again. Put it right there. And then we want to clear this out. So there's a lot of other softwares we could use for this, folks. I'm just going with this because. All right. So have we ran this on here before? I seven twelve seven hundred. I nine. So you kind of see where the score was. This is uh, R twenty. R twenty three will give you different scores. And let's go ahead and run it. Look like we can. Uh, uh oh. Current EDP limit throttling, folks. We're not going to hit any of the other stuff, but uh, wow. So that probably is, no, well, actually, new high score for the, the i7 on here. Um, yeah, I was kind of surprised by that, but the same thing happens with the i9. So... There you go, though. Like I said, we'll put this in the uh, comparison. Hopefully, I'll remember to put the, uh, you know, when it had a limit throttling in it. Thanks for checking out the video, folks. Please like, please subscribe. Thank you.